me down. <laughs> Been tried and tried digging from my town. Riders came and snatched that stone. But the hunter come to bring it home. This hell is a home. Bad should be mine. There's no way Sheriff gave it to you. There's just no way. Well, that's what the bounty hunter said. And why would they lie? They don't owe me dirt. Why'd Sheriff pick you then? Huh? What the hell did he see in you? I don't know. Didn't have a chance to find out. But if you want to dig up the old bastard and ask him yourself, by all means, go ahead, Titus. Got a shovel out back you can use. Now you listen here. The only man in town who ever trusted you is dead. I know it, and you know it. I do know it. I've lived with it every damn day since I got here. Now, if you're looking to scrap Titus, take your shot. I got some grief to work out. Well, I'm right here, Titus. Oh, I I'm thinking about it. You just let me know. Lucas, that one there. Die. I suppose that's the way of things. But we don't have to forget. Vault Hunter figured it was time to show Juno the big and ugly that Rose was looking to hatch. Hey, Bounty Hunter. Titus was just leaving. Yeah, I think I'd better be off. For your sake, Juno. You be careful around the hatch, Tomodachi. She's got so much blood on her hands, she can't see the lines anymore. Well, how'd it go up there? You didn't find the stone, I'm guessing it's bad news. 
So, turns out that the stone is really an egg. Inside, this big beastie called the Ruiner. The Ruiner? Wait, something's wrong. Incoming! Mercy, protect us! Tell us the rest of you get to see this all the time. in town? That don't make no damn sense. They never come up here. Don't matter. Fight now, talk later. Let's go, bounty hunter! Trigger fingers getting tired off the here. Well, drink that. What's next then, Sheriff? Oh, don't you call me that. Now walk with me. I'd have said. Look, I used to be a devil rider. They called me the hatchet. I killed plenty in my time, and I'll take that to my grave. That's why the town don't trust me. We used to just raid the town for supplies. But when Rose took over, things changed. She wanted a massacre. I couldn't take that kind of blood on my hands, so night before, I slipped out to warn these towny bastards. Even helped to fight off the Devil Riders myself. After that, Sheriff let me stay. Said you ain't gonna find forgiveness here, but you can damn well fight for it. Titus thinks I'm fighting to save the town. More like I'm trying to save myself. Anyway, we're gonna fight this fight together, I just thought you should know. Sheriff had some guns here. I'd say you earned them. Well, keep a move on. No sense lollygagging. Oi!
Hey, friends! The Ruiner. Rose used to talk about it from time to time. We all thought she was touched. Guess we were wrong. Now, I don't know how Rose plans to hatch that egg, but there's someone who might. Old crone by the name of Oletta lives in the forest. Go see what she knows. The old woman ain't a devil rider, but that don't mean she cares about us neither. Here's hoping Rose ain't killed her yet. Devil riders are coming back sooner or later. They always do. I gotta stick here and prepare the town. Oh, it was a hell of a thing, the hatchet turning on the devil riders like she did. Whew, when Rose found out, she put quite the price on Juno's head. Even offered some extra coin if some mean bastard could manage to do the deed with her own hatchet. <laughs> and slogan, you mesmerized moron! You see that?
Doc Stanley's genuine miracle elixir. I am dubious at best. That's the one! Bring it back! And thank you kindly. Now I'm gonna pay you for your trouble. But first, give me that cure for what ails me. Well being, here I come! <laughs> <sighs> See, Hina? Good as new. Wait, what? Oh, no! Ah! Elon, no! Damn it. Can't rightly believe I lost another husband. <sighs> I tried telling the fool that elixir was hogwash, but there ain't no cure for stupid. Yeah, I know, he just died, but facts are facts. Damn you, Doc Stanley. We gotta destroy his whole operation so ain't no one else widows by spontaneous combustion. We'll start by taking out his raw materials. There's a pumping well he's got providing liquid core for his elixir refinery. How about you take it out? And so the Vault Hunters set off to sabotage Doc Stanley's whole operation. Figure that a crook like Doc Stanley would partner up with the Devil Riders. No doubt they were getting a cut of the take. Doc Stanley's been preying on sawed brain folk like my late husband for too long. Let's increase the pressure on that pumping wheel and cut off his supply. Double it up! You got a death wish? My middle name.
a sarsaparilla, a shot of liquid core, and a dash of devil pepper. Then have the gall to call it a miracle cure. Wish I'd thought of that. Doc Stanley produced his miracle elixir out of old company refinery equipment. There was nothing refined about his operation. Now, let's take the fight to Doc Stanley by using his own damn elixir again him. Find some so we can get this explosive show started. <laughs> some frontier justice. I'm on fire! But not literally. Job well done! Only it's not working. Oh, come on, then. It just needs a bit of encouragement. Do what you do best. Light it up and watch it burn! Ain't seen that much fire and chaos since the bloodbath at Quinceanera Gulch. That two-bit con artist just got a taste of his own medicine! Job ain't done yet, though. Keep at it. Now that Doc Stanley's elixir inventory is gone to ruin, why don't you go ahead and destroy all his refinery equipment so we can't produce any more of that trash? We're looking to act the wagon. Anything stole. End of the road for you.
your quarrel, friend, I got the cure. How's a lifetime supply of Doc Stanley's Miracle Elixir sound? I probably drunk first, but I think I'll pass. Ah! First time I've ever refused a strong drink, come to think of it. Well, well, we got ourselves a negotiator. Okay, okay, I've got just the thing for you. Here, catch! Oh, thank you, gunslinger. Doc Stanley can't fool brain dead. Like my late husband no more. And hey, now that my dumb husband ain't spending my every last penny on some hogwash cure, I can afford to pay ya. Plenty of desperate folks out there looking for a miracle. At least now there's one less miracle hawker on Gehenna. But if I know one thing, it's that miracles don't come in bottles. Now, can I interest you in a sample of Doc Hena's miracle grenade?
The forest. Dangerous place, eh? Full of strange flora and stranger fauna, including wayward core-infused experiments from, you guessed it, the company ah. days. to believe, but the Devil Riders actually got the railway working again. What they were doing with it, though? Well, they'll find out soon enough. <laughs> Suckers!
woman lived all alone in the heart of the forest. She was a strange bird, that one. Forest told me someone was coming. So, why are you here? Juno sent me. Juno? I haven't talked to her since she went and moved into that human cage they call a town. Can't imagine what business she'd have with me. What's this about? What's the deal with this ruiner I've been hearing about? Rose is trying to hatch it. Of course she is. The fool. This way. Come on now. I'll tell you what I know. I need your help with something. The Ruiner. Huh. Company always loved its dramatic names. Interitus Regina was designed as the apex of bioengineered weapons. Company scrapped the project when they realized it couldn't be controlled. Stay sharp, bounty hunter. Waylon Hurd usually lurks around there. He's the quickest digger on Gehenna and he likes to spend time underground. How about you go ahead and put him there for good? There's a piece of raw core over there. Grab it for me. I used to work for the company, you know. The Dominus Project. That was mine. Good, good. Now, bring it here. Just give me a moment to work. You see, I believe I found a way to temporarily charm a hostile creatures, and even humans. <laughs> the Mentus Dominion, or Mentonets, to keep it simple, are unique species of parasitic bugs which, when exposed to infused core, can seize the minds of their victims. In theory, anyway. 
now for the final step. Ooh, this is exciting. There. Infused core. Quite a bit more potent than its raw form. Go on, take it. This way. Come on now. Now. Add a small piece of the infused core to each of the Menta Nat's breeding containers. There are only a few left that still need it. I've already taken care of the others. If my experiment is successful, you'll be able to temporarily turn enemies into allies. Meaning you just might survive this place. And sure, Rose may have passed through here safely, but she has her own men. the men to nets, and we'll see if the experiment was a success. Look, out there! It's working! The bugs will now be attracted to the Gallius Vertium Flora across Gehenna, more commonly known as Traitor Weed. Agitating the plant will cause the bugs to seek a nearby host. <laughs> Taking notes. Don't hold back. <laughs> no, not me. Shoot him. Wait, do you hear that? The wild bellics. They don't like seeing one of their kind dumb. The bugs! Don't forget the bugs! Turn them against each other! Ah, ah, look at the static! There, you see? The Manta Nats will help keep you safe. Well, safer at any rate. Now I'll come show you the way to Rose. As I said, Rose went to the mines to load up a train full of coal. With enough, she may succeed in hatching the Ruiner. That cannot happen. You must stop her. This is as far as I go. Farewell, gunslinger. Everyone on this backwater rock knew about Oletta. Some said she was the one who told Rose about the Ruiner. Then again, some folks are liars. I should know. Gah! Symmetrified wounds? Looks to me like the Hydragoyans work. Do us all the kindness of relieve the beast of its hide, would you? Take it! I'll be long soon. I'm trying to wallpaper my whole house in leather. Nothing's 
cozier than being totally surrounded by hide. That's why nature gave us skin. Hunter didn't know where that train was headed, but knew if it got there, it was going to be trouble. The question was, how to stop the train? Need some bombs. Lots of bombs. They did indeed need bombs. Soft for Gehenna, anyway. But I saw how he doted on her, and well, I can't say it wasn't endearing. As it turned out, Oletta wasn't all hard edges after all. Imagine that.
been a wild thing for a time now. Used to say she even wants to return, but that's up to her. If she gets a whiff of Titus's scent, maybe it'll jog her memory. And I've got just the thing. A pair of Titus's trousers. Don't ask. Wasn't planning on it? Don't wanna know. There are some mysteries we ain't meant to know. We'll need to draw Bella out of her lair. Get some prime devil meat as a lure. There are some feisty devils that dwell in the cave system up ahead. Magnificent specimens. Butcher them for some great a devil stay. Careful, though. From our radioactive as nuclear waste. And the others are coursing with electricity. Take your pick. Because Bella ain't exactly picky. Bella was a runt when Titus set her loose. I didn't think she'd last a day. But now she's made of herself a matriarch. The girl's got some fight in her, no question. We'll see how she reacts to you. No promise. Active meat didn't look too appetizing to the Vault Hunter, but what did they know about the Bellic's diet? <laughs> knew what to do. It was time to draw Bella out of her lair. They gathered up all the electrified meat, too. It's always nice to have options. Decided on the radioactive meat, looking to lure out little Bella. And what do you know? She took the bait. Now Bella seemed friendly enough, but would she take to Titus's scent after all these years? Vault Hunter placed the pants on the ground. Titus's pants smelled like dreams deferred and a yearning for something lost. Also, days old hotcakes for some reason. Looks like she missed Titus as much as he missed her. 
But the local bellocks didn't take too kindly to their matriarch turning her back on my family. That's a good looking bullet spot! The beast seemed like she was following a scent on the breeze. Hell of a nose on those bellocks. Vault Hunter tailed her to make sure she made it. There's someone back in town who misses you. Remember Titus, don't you? <laughs> Another pair of Titus's pants. What is going on with you? Hey, I said don't ask, didn't I? That is so, girl. Huh. So the old girl actually understands you, or what? Let's just say it's part of my charm. At any rate, I'm sure Titus will appreciate what you've done. I'll pick up the reward for Titus when I get into town. Here's your cut. Let's go, Bella. You haven't forgotten your way back to town, have you? Oh, come on, I'll show you.
Wouldn't know it from looking at it, but they sure packed a bunch. So, you made it to the forest. Whoa. Good for you, but it doesn't matter. Well, You're just a bounty hunter, and still don't understand how it works around here. There's only one thing strong enough to tame Gehenna. We're not about to hatch it. Mighty handy, laced with refined core for a bit of extra oomph. She put her heart Trophy of me. Then the fight comes. But I'll finish what she started. Bring her dream to life. Then Gehenna will be mine. And there won't be anyone fool enough to try to take it from me. Time to find that train and blast it sky high! No time to lose. Vault Hunter had to find a shortcut. Duh. The tunnel had collapsed. Company never bothered to clear it out.
<laughs> yep, told you they bad your punch. The shortcut worked wonders. Vault Hunter set to planting those explosives on the tracks. Luckily, the train didn't come along till they were done. Trust me on that. That's just how stories work. Another step in Sato's journey awaits at a nearby journal. See if you can find it. Captured a devil rider today. Made him tell us about the code. It's kill or be killed, mostly. Killing the weak's fine. Killing the strong, though? Now that's how you move up. The ink, that's only for the big kills. Which gave me an idea. What if we covered ourselves in tattoos and bluff our way into the gang? Just might last long enough to meet their leader. And take them down. Bombs were set. Now for my favorite part. And those devil riders didn't even get a chance to hit the brakes. <laughs> Final stop. Now the vault hunter needed to find out where that train was going. Figured the conductor would know. If he was still in one piece. <laughs> <laughs>
beautiful last words out of that bastard. Luckily, that wasn't the conductor. There he was, the conductor. But your rose is gonna make you pay for that. <laughs> See you in ruin, bounty hunter. Gunslinger. It was time to find out what that cackling bastard knew. You're not looking so hot, brother. Where was this train going? And be quick about it. <laughs> Facility doesn't matter now. <laughs> what was the last shipment? <laughs> Rose has been transporting core to some facility. Yeah, I know where it is. Been there before. I'll meet you outside. You ain't getting in without my help.
That was where the company started this whole mess. A good enough place to end it. Identified. Granting access to Telezapper Network. There you go. Now look, Rose must be using core to power a company launcher of some sort. If anything's got the firepower to crack that egg, it's company tech. Find that launcher and shut her down. Vault Hunter couldn't use that company gadget just to do <sighs> I told you that Telezapper should get you where you need to get. Don't be scared, just go. I've missed you, little friend. I gotta head back to town. Believe it or not, I put Titus in charge. That mangy bastard better open the gates for me. Watch out for Rose. She got her eye on you. posted up near you. He's got some newfangled tech that makes him hard to pin down. So do me a favor and nail his ass to the wall. Get the new guy! Idiots! Yeah. 
plenty of one or both of them. Ever driven a man mad? You ever wanted to? Care to help me get some vengeance? Care to help me get some vengeance? Now listen up, gunslinger. You ever hear the legend of the... Meet Mom. Doesn't ring a bell. He's a ghost story from round here. It said he's a monster who wanders the vast. A cursed hunk of rotten flesh with eyes of glowing core and a fiery demeanor. Now, I ain't superstitious, but I know a murdering bastard who is. And I say we scare him straight to the end of his wits with the legend of the meat man. First, grab that frame. Devils, the beasts, it all came from here. The facility was a bastion of clever folk and fancy tech. And hubris. The company had a name. But you won't hear anyone around here offer it freely. Same reason you hold your breath while you pass the <gasps> graveyard. Inside. <laughs> Fancy looking tech right there. <laughs> Didn't seem like the Vault Hunter could use it yet, though. Behind, aren't you? 
I think you know by now that there's always another way in. Telezapper. That was a ticket. To a lot of folk, the company facility was a tomb. Not for dead men. Or Gehenna the company buried when they left. Not many of the grit to set foot on the company's grave. You know, my grandmother worked here. Right in this building, in fact. Recruited for Project Endless Horizons. Brilliant woman, so I've been told. And hey, I'm just trying to honor the family legacy here. You understand, don't you, Gunslinger? Ooh! Over that! try. <laughs> Not quite. Concentrate, Rose. This is important. You have to get it right. Your grandmother taught this song to me when I was a little girl. And you know what she used to say to me? What'd she say, Mama? This song just might save your life someday. Facility. Our elite team has been recruited from throughout the system to participate in Project Endless Horizons. All of our exciting progress is thanks to Malleus Mutatio, or CORE. 
None of our projects would be possible without it. Core, the element that sparks new life into our bio-enhanced flora and fauna. Core, which fuels our experimental weaponry and tech programs. From our groundbreaking Telezephyr network to innovations in long-range ballistics, this is Project Endless Horizons, the future of the Jacobs Corporation. It's almost funny, you know. The company claimed the ruiner could be tamed. But they were wrong. Dead wrong. My grandmother was smarter than any of those empty suits. She knew exactly how to control it. And so do I. When the company shut down the facility and abandoned Gehenna, they bombed what they could and left. But my grandmother couldn't leave her work behind. When the last shuttle hit orbit, she was right there flipping at the bird and shouting, COWARDS! in a chest. Vault Hunter eventually used the breeze bloom they found and rode the material transport boxes to get where they were going.
when you need a dose of the red stuff, come find me. Time to stop the launch. The back road. I've got more than enough firepower to have the move. If I can do the new gun again, you don't want to miss the show.
Welcome back, little friend. You're telling me Rose is gonna wake up a gigantic company monster? We're screwed, Juno! We're screwed! Say it a little louder, Titus. I don't think the whole damn town heard you. Well, what the hell are we gonna do? We got a hard enough time as it is just fighting the devils and the gang. Me and you are the only ones keeping this town together. Now I need you, Titus. Don't go belly up on me. Oh, I ain't going be- uh, Now, hold up. You need me? Clean your ears. I ain't gonna say it again. I'll be here if you need me. there. Well, you're alive. Any other good news? Nope. Rose got away. I figured. But we know where she's going now. Incoming! The sky's raining fire! Ah, ruin. Find shelter, everybody! Devil Rider's coming. Bounty Hunter, you're up!
out, Sheriff. You ain't done yet. You don't kill me for nothing. <laughs> you. You saved my damn life. Yeah, well, don't go thinking you can give up the badge that easy. Fair enough, Deputy. Not over yet, bounty hunter. Devil Riders ran off licking their wounds. I say we take the fight to them. You thinking we go for a ride, Sheriff? Yeah, that's on my mind. Well, you ready to collect on that bounty? Darn tootin', I am ready for a hootenanny! Yeehaw! Cowboy stuff. Meet you outside town, then. Not bad fighting, Titus. You weren't so bad yourself, Sheriff. Sheriff? Not no more, you're not. You're riding with us. You heard the sheriff. Saddle up! <laughs> well, all right then. Welcome back, little friend. Get yourself a ride, bounty hunter.
End of the road. Time to take on Rose. You might be wondering why they call me the liar. Well, some say it's on account of what I swear transpired next. But to be honest, I hardly believe it myself. But the Vault Hunter descended toward Crater's Edge, their iron hot in hand, with enough grit to sand a tree trunk smooth. They were ready to fight, and good thing, too. Rose had slipped through their fingers too many times but there was nowhere left for her to run. It was a dead end. Aptly named. Ruins coming. And I'll be the one holding the reins. Come on, gunslinger. Draw.
kill the world. Save the town. Simple as so. They're long gone nowadays, but their legend remains. Of course, there was still the matter of the bounty. It was time to head back to town to collect. <laughs> Lucas, that one there. See that there? Well,
change in the ballpark. gonna get me down been tried and tied taken from my town riders came and snatched that stone but the hunter come to bring it home this hell is a home where the food Bones living all alone Whisper sweet with a devil tone Riders aim to take that train But it all came crashing down in flames And this hell Hell's a home Where the food And we pay mighty sum But all that changed when the hunter came to town Butcher's got a heart of stone And crack that egg with ruined cone Flames on high came raining down Spelling doom for all folks round And this hell, hell's a home Where the fool, the fool rides alone And we But all that changed when the hunter came to town The butcher died and a monster too And the rider's gang was all but through Redemption came for the traitor now A home, a home where fools ride along. And we, we didn't run, and we paid, we paid a mighty sum. All that changed when the hunter, this head.
るな。